close your eyes. Put your hands on your heart. Take a long deep breath in and let go. Once again, take a long deep breath in, breathe in from your nose, breathe out from your mouth three times. Once again, breathe in from your nose, breathe out from your mouth. And as you start breathing normally, observe every breath going deeper and deeper. Some of you can already feel the intensity. Don't resist it. Don't check out. Be present. Be present with your body. Take all your attention to your body. Your body has its own intelligence and every cell of your body has its own intelligence and has its own memory. We call it cellular memory. Now, wherever in your body you hid or stored the grief, the pain, the energy of the suffering. Let your attention go there. And it can be any part of your body. It can be more than one. That's perfectly all right. And some of you may experience that surfacing up while we are taking our attention there. Don't worry about it. It is all just surfacing up to release. It will be okay. And if you get emotional while doing it, don't stop that. Allow yourself to express it whichever way your body chooses to express it. Now expand your awareness and connect yourself to the universe. Connect yourself with the Mother Earth. Please know you are not alone. You are an infinite being, a spiritual being having a physical experience through this physical body. And there are many other physical bodies that you come in connection with as you choose to experience all the flavors of the buffet called life. There are soul groups. There are beings you may have had promises, vows, oaths with, and you choose to be born with them many times over a period of lifetimes, sometimes. That is all that it is. Everything else is the attachments of this reality. These are all the beings you have chosen to come and gift to you. Sometimes sweet experiences, sometimes bitter experiences, sometimes sour experiences. They all did their job. Sometimes by being in your life and sometimes by leaving. Even by leaving, they were being a contribution. Allow the shaft of white light to come from the universe on the top of your head and slowly and gradually move through, through every cell of your body. Every cell of your body right from the top of your head, your forehead, your eyes, your nose, your face, your throat, your shoulders, your heart, 
and now pull the energy from the earth to your feet all the way up to your legs your knees your thighs your hips your genitals your entire digestive system your lower back your middle back all the way up to your lungs and your heart and allow the healing energy of the universe and the earth to heal your heart while your true mother and the father the universe and the earth is healing your heart allow archangel azrael to contribute to download the wisdom you require around losing There is nothing wrong in the universe and everything that happens in your life has a purpose. Sometimes it could be not so very comfortable experience and we make it wrong. And we make ourselves wrong or someone wrong or the universe wrong, God wrong. What if no one was wrong? Whatever happened happened. they had to go flower kindlers rain to heal all the webs of doubt regret pain hurt from your heart from your body from your aura from the energy around your subtle bodies every way you lost someone and you concluded everything you concluded when you lost someone or something everywhere you went into you are not good enough you don't deserve it you will never love anyone again just allow all of that to just release out of your cellular memory into this divine white light allow yourself to have all your actually a lot of you already have your spirit guides around you they are all there to support you to tell you you are not alone we are with you some of you may even have your loved ones around you as your angel Don't try to understand it. Don't resist it. If you have an awareness that they are, then they are. Just trust your awareness. And just like that, you can talk to them. It's much better talking to them like this than it was talking to them when they were in physical body. trust your answers trust the awareness that you're getting and allow yourself to release the pain that you concluded in this life or any other lifetime that this will never go 
and it is not going only because you said it will never go. Everywhere you sentenced yourself to the lifetime imprisonment of your pain and suffering because once upon a time you were hurt and you concluded, I will never forget this. This will always pain. This will always hurt. All of that, just revoke that today and surrender all of that to your angels, to your guides right now. Let all of that go. It can release. 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 Allow yourself to be empty of any pain or suffering or hurt. And any energy of hurt or pain or suffering you have in your body, in your physical body, energy body, that you picked up from others. Some of you are healers. You have a capacity to heal other people and you don't even realize. Every time you go like, oh, I wish they don't have to suffer. How much do you try to take their suffering and then you lock it into your body. And then you wonder, why am I sad? Allow your body to release all those secret pain, suffering, hurt that you have hidden in your body, in your subtle bodies. Because you didn't want it to go back to those people. So you lock them in your body. It's time to unlock. Allow yourself to be empty. There is nothing wrong in empty. You don't have to fill up your emptiness with the heaviness of this reality. Empty is beautiful. It is space. It is divine. And in that emptiness, you can choose to fill anything in it. Many of you are were not able to create greater realities for yourself. Beside the fact you wanted to and beside the fact you are capable to because there is no space for anything new to show up. Your mind, your body, your aura was so full of all the past grief and pain and suffering. Allow all of that to release so that you have a lot of space for new to show up. Just release, release, release. There is nothing to be sad about. Your people have just changed their form. They are not over, they are infinite beings. You can rather have a stronger connection with them now if you choose to. Or you can just choose to let them move on. Choice. More than anyone else, let yourself free. Allow the golden sparkles to flow through this bright white light coming from the universe into every cell of your body and this bright white light expands and create a huge ball of light around you now with these golden sparkles of joy and wisdom and enthusiasm, filling your aura, filling your body. And 
anywhere any one of you learnt from people around you knowingly or unknowingly that you cannot be happy you should not be happy you are supposed to be sad what if it's not true what if you can be happy you must be happy it's only the unaware who give up their joy for the lies of this reality your joy is the real truth that is who you are as an infinite being the vibration of joy just embrace it and be it and commit to it and do not give it up no matter what and you don't have to convince people why are you happy just have your own happy space your own little secret of joy hmm. something shifted there thank you spirit guides thank our angel israel thank the energy of the universe and the mother earth smile take a long deep breath and slowly and gradually being very present of every cell of your body right from the top of your head into the tips of your toes integrate with your physical body totally and completely This is your best friend in this life. Your body. And slowly and gradually whenever you feel comfortable, you can open your eyes.